As the filtrate moves down the loop of Henle, the concentration of solutes increases in the interstitial fluid surrounding the nephron tubule. Since this portion of the tubule is permeable to water, water leaves by osmosis and is reabsorbed into the blood. This concentrates the filtrate. In the ascending loop, the surrounding fluid becomes more dilute. This portion of the loop is impermeable to water but not sodium chloride. Sodium chloride diffuses out, lowering the solute concentration of the filtrate and adding to the solute concentration of the surrounding fluid. Near the top of the loop, sodium chloride is actively transported out, further diluting the filtrate. More substances are reabsorbed from the distal tubule. Sodium chloride is actively transported out of the filtrate. Bicarbonate ions may be reabsorbed too, helping to regulate body pH. Some drugs and poisons are secreted from the blood into the filtrate at this point. And this is another place where hydrogen ions may also be secreted into the filtrate to further adjust pH. There is a lot going on here. The main point is that the nephron is able to expel unneeded or harmful substances from the blood by filtration and secretion into the filtrate, and the nephron can reabsorb substances useful to the body.